Greetings everybody and welcome back to Daddy the Grand, the Grand Daddy Plays Smite, Battleground of the Gods. I gotta say, playing Smite on the weekends, it can be taxing. It can be a very, very taxing experience. But here I am, Sunday morning, playing Smite. Oh, we got it. Come here. There she is. Using my tremors here. Using a pot. We did some good damage there, so that's nice. That pillow ran like the sissy is. And someone took the rep off. Good. All good. All nice. All fine so far. Let's see if we can get something in here. And can slow him down a bit. Oh, he's solo. Nice job. Very nice job indeed. Finishing the job on the Yomongana, who I consider to be one of the scarier gods on their lineup. I have a lot of respect for this god. I should play him soon again. I just enjoy being Yomongana so much. He has such a fun kit. Works in a lot of different ways with a lot of different items. And it's just super fun to play. Mm, that's okay, damage. Oh! She silenced me. They're actually buffing that silence effect next patch. It will give a shield. Well, let's, let's not say it's a buff. It's actually a change for the most part. Because it's actually pretty good right now as well. It gives a huge amount of magical protections if used under the correct circumstances. Yormungana knows what's up, he doesn't want to approach me while my ultimate is up, because he knows that if he does that, he's gonna die. So, smart man, I appreciate that. And yeah, I want you to clear all of these out. Thanks. Alright. Yormungana, come out a bit. Move out a bit, let me get a snack at you. I mean, he's level 5 now, so you will make it out one way or the other. There's the next red buff. I just want to be here when she clears out this wave. Getting all these juicy, juicy Guardian's Blessing stacks. And there's Yamagunder. And... Ah, she just needed to pop it. Good. Yeah, that was nice. We reacted pretty okay there. Got the Yomon Gunner for it. He should have just ulted immediately when he had the chance. And because he didn't, he suffered for it. Can't get to her, sadly, so let's go back to base. Grab my boost. You know what? Let's save for this wave, too. Good. And yeah, this is one of the reasons why I like Guardian's Blessing so much. The item gives you a lot of extra gold and it just keeps you around the block for long enough to actually get something good starting for your team. Um, I actually have no idea what I want to build on this. Probably going to be some kind of bruiser approach. I've been playing Kabraken a lot, a fairly lot. He is my most played god in the game. Played him back when nobody thought he was good. And while there's a lot of charm to his very, very bursty playstyle, I actually never was all about that. It's fun, but it kind of loses novelty a bit fast, at least for me. But being a bruiser, making good use of all the abilities, not just for myself, but also for my teammates, there's a certain level of satisfaction to that. Uh, Nua's ultimate should still be up, so no point going for her. Oh, that was Bastard's jump, I heard that. There's Apollo, I won't be approaching Apollo either. At least I got that out. Oh, that's bad. Mmm, that's good. Oh, that's bad. Hey. That was a good ultimate from the Ching Tian there. And there's the Yormungandr ultimate. Actually hit me with that. But he isn't going to pursue any further. I need to go back here because I'm pretty low on HP. Um, let me have my Wardstone here. Seems to be a good call for the most part. Oh, he died anyway, eh? 
So here's the thing. In my opinion, a Yomongana should never die when he uses his ultimate. He should either get one, two, or three kills out of the situation, or make a clean escape. Okay, she died. Man, approaching Isis is actually super annoying as Kabrakan. She has a lot of tools to just counter your initiation. Unless you have Blink, of course, then she is... Even then she can sometimes screw it with her at 3 still. Then she follows that up with a blink, uh, with a silence. And then you are sitting back while she is making her clean escape. Nice. Uh, let me see. Oh yeah, you know what, I'll put a second point in my tremors. Because it's just a good increase on my base damage on that ability, I actually watch out for these kind of things quite a bit. Yeah, Isis and Apollo, they don't make for attractive targets for me, so... There's the Isis again, though, if she is... Oh! That was not the play. She used her 2 on someone else. And that was the moment she knew that she was over with. Apollo playing it very self, uh, safe. Playing very late back. Which is good. For him, that is. Oh, that's huge. Oh, she got beats. Why didn't she beats immediately? Oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's a lot of damage on the Yamagunda. Ah, the Isis needs to pop her ultimate a bit sooner. Just a slight bit sooner. But damn, how is Yamagunda still level 9? Uh, Xing Tian. He had a lot of damage dealt in. Got one kill. Let's get my blink here. It's a shame. Okay, so I want some CDR next. Not sure which CDR item I'm going to go with. Probably Genji's Guard, looking at how the game is looking right now. Oh, damn! Oh. Right. Oh. Damn. Yeah. Got her, and I make a run for it. Some help will be very much appreciated. Oh, uh, thanks. Ah, uh, Apollo still has his ultimate. I haven't seen him use it once, though, so maybe it's down. Hey, I'm getting Genji Scarred here. It's... They line up for the moment very heavy in the magical damage department. Nura, Isis, Yomungandr, and so far, I feel like I haven't made much contact with the Apollo and the Bastard. It has been pretty much Isis and Yomungandr for the most part. So, yeah, that will be a good pickup for me. And she missed her Spirit Ball. Apollo put me with a basic attack. Son of a gun, yes. Oh, Yomungandr, he has his ultimate. Oh. And yeah, the Xing Tian is getting good plays off. And we are going to help on this side of the map, of course. <laughs> that was a good silence from the Isis there, too. She jumped out. That was a good silence from the Isis there, because it kept him from ulting. Where's he ulting to? Okay, he came down at the red buff. I can't recall. Has Nua ulted even once in this game? I can't recall having seen any damage coming from her on me. I don't think she did, or did she? Oh, she's tempting me. That's a mistake. Oh. Yeah, I'm safe. Oh, she used her clay soldiers, and that was the moment where I knew I could kill her. Because that was her. Oh, she can the ultimate. No, can't get anything out of that, sadly. Need to go back here. Her clay soldier explosion was the only thing she could do in order to counter me, and she 
botched that opportunity. Your team has destroyed her right and then she died for it. Bellona looks safe. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Be careful, right. Uh, Izanami. Whoops. Warning. It's a shame. There's Yomagander's ultimate. Was that one or two gems? One jump. Isis and Apollo both on this side of the map. Whoa. Damn. Nice to. Very nice. Oh, there's Yamagunner, okay. Drinking another potion. That Nuva looks delicious over there. Xing Tian is going for her too. Oh, she left. Bastard looking, waiting in the jungle. And she left. I think she was trying to ambush there. And then I ambushed her and it was good. It was fun. It was a good experience, as I like to say. Okay, next item, I'm probably going to go with... Mantle of Discord, I suppose. Maybe something with HP on it. Or maybe both. I still have two open item slots, I can go with both. There's the Apollo, there's the Yomungander, and there's the dead Nuwa. Yeah, and the Xing Tian is doing a great job at keeping the pressure on, on those jokers. Oh, there's a dead Yormungander. <laughs> Deleted in every sense of the word. Oh, hey. Deleted in every sense of the word. Literally. Quite literally. Bastard looking frisky. But she has a jump, so no choice. No chance in getting her. You know what, I'm going for a red buff here. I'll drop it for the Izanami. Or oh, whoever wants it. All people on the team are doing great. I'm not top damage and I always take that as a sign for people doing good. So yeah, people, if you ever meet me in a game, if you ever meet me in a game and want to be on a good footing with me, just deal more damage than me. You will always find me being very appreciative of people who would just deal more damage than me. That's Apollo in a nutshell. Oh, that's good though. Ah, here, please. Oh, that's a shame. I got my ultimate now. What does Yormungandr have? A decent amount of protections. Ah, oh. oh, my one is back up again. Oh! Okay, I need to get out. I'm dead. That's a shame. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. As soon as I approach a fight with the Apollo, he has a, such an easy time to controlling me. Now it all falls apart, Ken. That's actually kind of terrifying. And terrible, too. Let me have my Metal of Discord. And you know what? You know what? No, let's make a mature decision here and grab the... Magi's Cloak instead. They have so much CC, I'm going to need it, probably. Oh, that's good. That's very nice. Very neat. Okay, I'm back. I have my Blink. I have my Ultimate. And I have pretty good gold on my hand. I'm top gold in the game right now. Also top kills. Which I do not care for that that much, all things considered. Oh. There's the blink. There we go. Uh, Apollo altered, it's down. Are you approaching that? No, you are not, right? Nah, didn't think so. I got my Magi's Blessing now, though. Uh. Ah, he has life steal. That was bad. Oh, he waved at me. Interesting. 
Okay, if I had Magi's Blessing there, that would have been a one fight. But I believe he wouldn't even approach that fight like he did there. Enemy ultimate down. Ah, the Apollo. And he had crit, of hey course. There, and I didn't have a lot of physical protection, so yeah, that was a bad fight to pick on my part. Let's just make note of that. And Xing Tian saved the Isis there big time. And I don't believe that Yomun Gunner has what it takes to kill him. Uh, to kill her. But Xing Tian has a good kill to keep him in check. And the Yomun Gunner should be dead here. He is. Let's hope that the bastard will not revenge kill. Oh, looks like she is. Let me grab this really quick. Xing Tian still in a fight. He's still at full health, so he may make something happen there. His ultimate is down, so apparently he just used it. But I have all my abilities and my Madras Blessing up, so I can make something happen in here. There's the Nuva, there's the Bastard. Ah! Oh, shame. I barely missed that attack. If I wouldn't have, she would have been... Ah, oh, maybe she would have died there. Anything in here? Also, shoutouts to the people who are warding. Anytime, baby. That's another thing that I appreciate greatly. Took the Apophis, that gives me a lot of extra damage, which is really nice. And there's the Nua, and the Bastard, and the Apollo, and the Yormungandr, and I shouldn't be here. They are coming towards right, I need to help there. Xing Tian looks like he's having trouble. You're welcome. Yeah, I'm having a bad track record landing that basic attack. I have to add that Kabarakan is in that weird zone where he's my most played god, yet I hardly if ever play him anymore. Oh. Bad news. And there was the Madras Blessing. And there's the Bastard. Can we get to her? Uh, I don't think so. She's pretty fast on her feet, but I have my one in a second again. Ugh. Let's see if we can help there, though. Mm -hmm. Oh no! She actually got out. That's a shame! Uh, yeah, let's actually distance ourselves a bit here. Go back to base, and now I will probably grab my... You know what, I'll go with Spirit Rope. They have so much to see that will likely mitigate a whole lot of damage. And now we have full CDR, we are fairly tanky. Have a good amount of HP on our hands. Magi's Blessing was very good for that, by the way. Gave us a nice added HP. I don't believe. How much is it? 300? 400? 300. Oh, yeah, they're fighting there. I'm going in. Oh. And that's the Apollo dead. Magi's Blessing carried that kill. She is out. Oh, damn. Oh no, I'm dead. It's a shame. Oh, no problem, we get the second Phoenix out of that. So that's okay. Ah, the Yomun Gunner is so close to being dead. He has next to no health. He shouldn't be aggressive now. He should go out. That's the play. That's the man. He's an army getting another cleanup kill there. That's nice. Yomun Gunner is out. He has to go back to the base. So she could get the newer here. Oh, that may be it. Uh, she had beats, good. She has her Aegis. Yormungandr is still in base, and there she goes. Awesome! I approve. Yeah, this game is looking like it's not gonna last all that much longer. And yeah, oh, everyone on the team has performed greatly overall. Oh, that's a shame. Apollo probably ulted in. Okay, I got my ultimate, I got my blink, I got my Magi's blessing up. Oh, damn. 
Mm, yeah. Okay, that's good. He didn't use that on me, so I can now catch up to him. Ugh, he had beats. Son of a gun. Oh no. Oh no. That's bad. I'm dead. Oh, I'm not dead. Oh, <laughs> that was a bit closer than it had any right to be. But I'm alive, and that's all that counts. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, the game is super fun, unless I have to deal with Apollo and Isis. Especially when they are together. They can just say and chichi me forever. MVP creep? I'm not sure what he means by creep. Alright. I can't catch her. Is she gonna jump? Oh, there's Inua. And the Yormungandr should be dead. Uh, can't you get him? Ah, oh, that's a shame. Damn. Oh, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. And we won. Distracted them long enough for Isis to take the Titan. They call me Masturbator. Isis actually managed to get more gold than me, that's nice. That's very good. Shows me that people care about farm. Especially if someone gets more gold than I do while I have Guardian's Blessing. That means that someone is doing good farm. Alright, I think everyone deserves this. Let's give it to them. And show me the final statistics. Yeah, GG, WP, everyone. Okay, that's the builds. All looks very nice overall. Yeah, the Bastard was actually doing a lot of damage. Less to me, but more to the others, but it ended up not being enough for us, sadly. Xing Tian had a lot of very good ultimates overall. I'm, I was enjoying that quite a bit. And yeah, below not me, when we were on the front line, it was a hard time for the enemies. Overall, a very fun game. I enjoyed it quite a bit. I have no idea when I did one structure damage. <laughs> That's nice. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. If you liked the video, let me know, and I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, have the greatest of days.